Hi, John here. I'm at the Emerald Hollow Mine in beautiful Hidden Night. It's kind of a busy day here, as you can see. So anyway, I uh, went through about two buckets of the dirt that I've been digging up for a while. And let me show you what I got. More of the green muscovite. There's some more. There's some really strong. And you can see right down in there the red rutile. So yeah, I'm gonna have to spend a little more time and a little more care with that one to get that cleared out. And a bunch of quartz crystals there. Let's get to the good stuff. Here's some of that pyrite staining on that crystal. And all of this are amethyst crystals. And just so you can get a feel for the size of them. They're all very small. There's a scepter right there. I got a lot of scepters. Let's go around. Still all amethyst right there. Now we're getting into some just quartz crystals right there. And right here is a tabby. Right there. And right there. Here's some here's some oddball stuff. Look at that. It is terminated. It is not broken at the end there. Here's some, I believe, limonite, but I'm not 100% sure on that. It definitely is an iron mineral. It looks like it feels kind of heavy, but. I have to get confirmation. And here is the root heel for the day. Look at that nice bright red. And some in the court. Yes. And this this is similar to that owl that I just had. It's got the two little horns at the top, and it's it has a similar shape. And then I found this crystal here. And another piece of retail sticking out of the crystal itself. <clears throat> Top three time, ready? Number three. I'm gonna get this wet because it's a, uh, it, it has root heel in it, and that root heel is really, really just bright red. There we go. And that's deep inside the crystal. Okay, so that's um, number three. Here's number two. Now, believe it or not, this is a crystal. It's a tabby. It's faced 
right there. Its face right there. The back side's faced. And it has a tip on it. That is a complete crystal. And here's number one. A reverse scepter. And this is of decent size. I know you've seen them, we pull them out before, but this one here is of decent size. Look at that beauty. Is that amazing? And all that nasty looking dirt to find something so beautiful. Well, that's it for now. I've still got like three more buckets to do, but this right here took about almost three hours to go through all of that. So, one quick overview. All of that.